the prevailing mainstream theory currently holds that approximately 13.8 billion years ago, this universe was born in a massive explosion, and time is measured from that moment. However, the emergence of Webb is gradually overturning the hypotheses that humans have believed for decades. Launched into the sky on December 25, 2021, and entering orbit around the Sun-Earth system on January 25, 2022, James Webb has become a time machine, rewinding humanity's past. Webb is the most modern and advanced eye of humanity as it orbits Earth at a distance for times that of the Moon, silently gazing into the deep space of the universe. It was hoped that Webb would find evidence to illuminate theories that have existed for hundreds of years, but unexpectedly, it is contributing to breaking down humanity's virtual walls about space. Out there in the deep, dark forest with thousands of twinkling lights, Webb has discovered the first newborns of the cosmic womb. They are ancient galaxies that have existed for 33 billion years. They are the farthest galaxies humanity has ever known. Once again, humanity will have to sit down and reconsider the theories it has painstakingly built. Now, welcome back to our journey through the reverse space, and this is Eyes 200M, where mysteries are revealed in the light of science. In the latest report on November 21, an international team led by researchers from Pennsylvania used JWST spectral data to confirm distances and explore the characteristics of ancient galaxies. They discovered the second and fourth distant galaxies in the Pandora cluster, Abel 2744. These ancient galaxies, located approximately 33 billion light-years away from us, provide crucial insights into the formation of primitive galaxies. On February 15, on NASA's official information page, astronomers revealed deep field images from the James Webb Space Telescope, including unprecedented details in a dark space region they named Pandora Abel 2744. When the images of the Pandora cluster were first sent by Webb, the research team was truly astonished. There were too many details in the foreground cluster and too many distant lensed galaxies, making it seem like they were getting lost in the image. Webb exceeded the expectations of all those who had anticipated its capabilities. The new view of Pandora's cluster stitched together four quick snapshots taken by Webb into a panoramic image displaying around 50,000 near-infrared light sources. In addition to magnification capabilities, the gravitational lens also distorts the shapes of distant galaxies, making them look very different from the foreground galaxies. The lensing effect caused by the massive galaxy cluster is a testament to the profound influence of gravity on the fabric of the universe. This gravitational lensing, as observed through the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, not only magnifies distant galaxies but also distorts their appearance, offering a unique window into the early universe. Through meticulous analysis, researchers have unveiled a treasure trove of mysteries hidden within these distorted images, shedding light on the fundamental nature of galaxy formation and evolution. One of the most intriguing aspects of this discovery is the revelation of ancient galaxies that challenge conventional theories of cosmic evolution. These primordial cosmic entities, dating back billions of years, defy our expectations by exhibiting characteristics typically associated with much younger galactic structures. Despite their immense age, these galaxies display a surprising level of maturity and mass, prompting scientists to re-evaluate our understanding of early universe dynamics. The discovery of these ancient galaxies opens a new chapter in our quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. It suggests that the process of galaxy formation may have commenced much earlier than previously thought, fundamentally altering our perception of cosmic evolution. By peering into the depths of space and time, JWST has provided us with a glimpse of the universe's infancy, offering valuable insights into the conditions that gave rise to the first galaxies. Moreover, the distorted images captured by JWST offer a compelling visual representation of the gravitational forces at play in the cosmos. The warping of space-time, induced by the massive galaxy cluster, serves as a cosmic magnifying glass, allowing us to peer into the distant past with unprecedented clarity. Through careful analysis of these distorted images, astronomers can reconstruct the history of galactic evolution, tracing the intricate pathways that led to the formation of the universe we see today. Beyond the scientific implications, the discovery of these ancient galaxies has profound philosophical implications. It forces us to confront our place in the vast tapestry of the cosmos and re-evaluate our understanding of humanity's role in the universe. 
the existence of these primordial cosmic entities reminds us of the fleeting nature of our existence and the enduring legacy of the cosmos. As we continue to probe the depths of space with ever more powerful telescopes, such as JWST, we are certain to uncover even more tantalizing mysteries awaiting discovery. Each new revelation brings us closer to unraveling the enigmatic origins of the universe and deepening our appreciation for the wonders of the cosmos. In conclusion, the discovery of ancient galaxies through the lens of the James Webb Space Telescope represents a watershed moment in our quest to understand the cosmos. These distant cosmic entities offer valuable insights into the early stages of galactic evolution and challenge our preconceived notions of cosmic history. As we gaze upon these distorted images from the dawn of time, we are reminded of the boundless potential of human exploration and the enduring mysteries that await us in the depths of space. Researchers note that along with gravitational lensing, the powerful infrared capabilities of JWST will be able to detect galaxies at even greater distances if they exist. Leia's team was thrilled and somewhat surprised when their proposal was accepted because it involved coordination, quick human action, and the telescope focusing on the same object twice, a significant demand for an astronomical telescope in its first year of operation. The pressure was immense as the research team had only a few months to identify the objects to observe. Galaxies in the early universe, cases like Abel 2744, are not the only remarkable results that James Webb has achieved in its nearly one year of operation. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has embarked on a monumental journey through the depths of space, peering back in time to unravel the mysteries of the early universe. Among its myriad discoveries, perhaps none are as captivating as the revelation of over 1,000 galaxies bearing an uncanny resemblance to our own Milky Way. Hidden within the cosmic tapestry of the early universe, these galactic twins offer a glimpse into a bygone era, where the seeds of cosmic evolution were first sown. What makes these galaxies particularly intriguing is their striking similarity to the Milky Way, our celestial home in the vast expanse of the cosmos. Like mirror images from across the eons, they boast shapes reminiscent of warped vinyl records, with intricately woven spiral arms that echo the majestic splendor of our own galaxy. Yet, what sets these cosmic doppelgangers apart is the epoch in which they reside, a time when the universe was but a fraction of its current age, and galaxies were still in the throes of their formative years. To understand the significance of these discoveries, we must delve into the cosmic history of the universe. Over 10 billion years ago, during a period of intense galactic activity, the early universe was a maelstrom of colliding and merging galaxies. These cosmic collisions, while violent and chaotic, gave rise to a rich diversity of galactic structures, ranging from majestic spirals to elliptical behemoths. It was within this crucible of cosmic evolution that the Milky Way and its counterparts were born, emerging from the chaos of the cosmos-like celestial phoenixes rising from the ashes. However, the prevailing wisdom among astronomers held that such intricate spiral galaxies were a rarity in the early universe. The turbulent environment of that era, marked by frequent galactic collisions and mergers, was thought to inhibit the formation of galaxies with well-defined spiral arms. Instead, it was believed that galaxies would be torn asunder by the gravitational forces at play, resulting in a population dominated by irregular and elliptical shapes. Yet, the discoveries made by JWST have turned this notion on its head, revealing a veritable treasure trove of spiral galaxies hidden within the cosmic haze of the early universe. These galaxies, with their graceful spirals and intricate structures, defy conventional wisdom and challenge our understanding of cosmic evolution. They offer a tantalizing glimpse into the tumultuous birth of galaxies, providing valuable clues about the processes that shape the universe as we know it today. One of the most remarkable aspects of these discoveries is the sheer abundance of spiral galaxies found in the early universe. With over 1,000 galactic twins of the Milky Way unearthed by JWST, Astronomers are left to ponder the implications of such a rich diversity of galactic structures. Could it be that spiral galaxies were more prevalent in the early universe than previously thought? Or perhaps there are underlying mechanisms at play that facilitated their formation in spite of the chaotic cosmic environment? Regardless of the answers, one thing is certain, the discoveries made by JWST have opened a new chapter in our understanding of the cosmos. They have challenged long-held assumptions and expanded our horizons, offering a fresh perspective on the early stages of galactic evolution. 
As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the universe, one thing remains clear, the cosmos is a vast and wondrous place, filled with countless wonders waiting to be discovered. In conclusion, the discovery of over 1,000 spiral galaxies by the James Webb Space Telescope represents a paradigm shift in our understanding of cosmic evolution. These galactic twins of the Milky Way offer a tantalizing glimpse into the tumultuous birth of galaxies in the early universe, challenging conventional wisdom and expanding our horizons. As we peer ever deeper into the cosmic abyss, we are reminded of the boundless potential of human exploration and the enduring mysteries that await us in the depths of space. The prevailing mainstream theory currently holds that approximately 13.8 billion years ago this universe was born in a massive explosion, and time is measured from that moment. However, the emergence of Webb is gradually overturning the hypotheses that humans have believed for decades. Launched into the sky on December 25, 2021, and entering orbit around the Sun-Earth system on January 25, 2022, James Webb has become a time machine rewinding humanity's past. Webb is the most modern and advanced eye of humanity as it orbits Earth at a distance for times that of the Moon, silently gazing into the deep space of the universe. It was hoped that Webb would find evidence to illuminate theories that have existed for hundreds of years. But unexpectedly, it is contributing to breaking down humanity's virtual walls about space. Out there in the deep, dark forest with thousands of twinkling lights, Webb has discovered the first newborns of the cosmic womb. They are ancient galaxies that have existed for 13.8 billion years. They are the farthest galaxies humanity has ever known. Once again, humanity will have to sit down and reconsider the theories it has painstakingly built. And now, welcome back to our journey through the reverse space, and this is the Eyes 200M where mysteries are revealed in the light of science. Pandora's Cluster, or Able 2744, in the latest report on November 21, an international team led by researchers from Pennsylvania used JWST spectral data to confirm distances and explore the characteristics of ancient galaxies. They discovered the second and fourth distant galaxies in the Pandora Cluster, Able 2744. These ancient galaxies, located approximately 13.8 billion light-years away from us, provide crucial insights into the formation of primitive galaxies. Pandora, Able 2744, is a unique galaxy cluster. On February 15, on NASA's official information page, astronomers revealed deep field images from the James Webb Space Telescope, including unprecedented details in a dark space region they named Pandora Able 2744. At that time, Webb's view displayed three very large galaxy clusters merging to form a supercluster. The combined mass of these galaxy clusters creates a strong gravitational lens, the natural magnification effect of gravity, allowing the observation of galaxies further away in the early universe. By using the cluster as a magnifying glass, James Webb is not the first eye to discover it. Previously, under the limited vision of Hubble, research groups from various universities had explored the core of this galaxy cluster. However, due to its limited capabilities, Hubble could not provide detailed parameters. Nevertheless, those passionate about the mysteries of space have never given up on it. Ancient mythology about Pandora narrates the curiosity and discoveries of humanity in distinguishing the past and the future, which is a fitting connection to the new frontiers of the universe that Webb is unveiling, including this deep field image of the Pandora Cluster. When the images of the Pandora Cluster were first sent by Webb, the research team was truly astonished. There were too many details in the foreground cluster and too many distant lensed galaxies, making it seem like they were getting lost in the image. Webb exceeded the expectations of all those who had anticipated its capabilities. The new view, new mode of Pandora's cluster, stitched together four quick snapshots taken by Webb into a panoramic image displaying around 50,000 near-infrared light sources. In addition to magnification capabilities, the gravitational lens also distorts the shapes of distant galaxies, making them look very different from the foreground galaxies. The lens of the large galaxy cluster is so massive that it warps the structure of space enough for light from those distant galaxies passing through the distorted space to also appear distorted. After careful study, they truly uncovered some remarkable mysteries. According to researchers, unlike other galaxies confirmed at this distance appearing as red dots in the images, the newly discovered galaxies appear larger and resemble a peanut and a cotton ball. The lead author, Bing Jia Wang, a postdoctoral scholar at Penn, 
says there's very little information about the early universe, and the only way to learn about that time and test our theories of galaxy formation and early development is with these very distant galaxies. Because light from these galaxies takes a very long time to reach Earth, it provides a window into the past. The research team estimates that the light detected by JWST originated from two galaxies when the universe was about 330 million years old and traveled about 13.4 billion light years to reach JWST. However, researchers note that these galaxies are currently approximately 13.8 billion light years away from Earth due to the expansion of the universe during this time. Joel Lee, an assistant professor of astronomy and astrophysics at the University of Pennsylvania and a member of Uncover, says the light from these galaxies is extremely ancient, about three times older than Earth. These primitive galaxies are like beacons with light bursting through a very thin layer of hydrogen, creating the early universe. Only through their light can we begin to understand the strange physical mechanisms that govern galaxies near the dawn of the universe. Notably, the two galaxies are considerably larger than the three galaxies previously located at these extreme distances. One is at least six times larger at about 2,000 light-years across. For comparison, the Milky Way is approximately 100,000 light-years across. But Wang said the early universe is thought to have been very compressed, so surprisingly, the galaxy is as large as it is. Wang explains previously discovered galaxies at these distances are point sources, they appear as a dot in our images. But one of ours appears elongated, almost like a peanut, and the other looks like a fluffy ball. It is unclear if the difference in size is due to how the stars formed or what happened to them after they formed, but the diversity in the galaxy properties is really interesting. These early galaxies are expected to have formed out of similar materials, but already they are showing signs of being very different from one another. Properties and implications, two galaxies among the 60,000 light sources in the Pandora cluster were discovered in one of the first deep field images taken by JWST in 2022, its inaugural year of scientific operation. This space region was chosen in part because it is located behind some galaxy clusters that create a natural magnification effect called gravitational lensing. The gravitational pull of the combined mass of the clusters warps the space around it, concentrating and magnifying any light that passes nearby, providing a magnified view behind the clusters. In a matter of months, the uncovered team narrowed down the 60,000 light sources to 700 candidates for further study, eight of which they believe could be among the first galaxies. Subsequently, JWST focused on the Pandora cluster again, capturing the spectra of the candidates, a type of fingerprint detailing the amount of light emitted at each wavelength. Lee explains different groups are using different methods to search for these ancient galaxies, and each group has its strengths and weaknesses. Focusing on this massive gravitational lens in space gives us an extremely deep window, but it's a very small window, so they're rolling the dice. Some candidates don't have convincing conclusions, and at least one of them is a case of mistaken identity, something much closer to mimicking a distant galaxy. The research teams are very fortunate it turns out there are these two ancient galaxies, unbelievable. Researchers also use detailed models to infer the characteristics of these primitive galaxies when they emit light detected by JWST.